So welcome back to more Mafia 3. Uh, so I tried to do a free roam video earlier. And I, I mean, I guess it went okay, but... I was trying to figure out, you know, why... Why there's not a free, lot of free roam videos on YouTube for this game yet. And I know, I now know why. That's because... If you go on a rampage, say you go on a rampage and something like that, and you go to go kill like a bunch of cops or something, they don't drop ammo for their guns. Like, they in fact they don't drop their guns at all. So whatever ammo that you go into the rampage with is all you have, which is ridiculous. To me. Oh shit! There's, speaking of cops, there's one now. I have to actually obey the traffic, but yeah. When is the light gonna turn green? But yeah, whatever. Shut up. Whatever ammo you go into the rampage with is all. Why would you sway swerve in front of me? moron but yeah all the all the ammo that you get you can't basically you can't pick up ammo so when you run out of ammo that's it that's the end of the rampage you just gotta get killed I, you know I, I I really like the game so far in fact it's one of my favorites of the year at least story wise but I feel like a lot of odd decisions like that are made gameplay wise that just don't make sense like stuff like no character customization uh, for some reason you can't pick up weapons from the cops when you kill them it just doesn't make sense you know like everything else about the game is great but some of the most odd stuff is left out like you would think that you'd at least want to test the rampage factor for your open world game but it's just not there so I don't know like I'm really I'm really a bit disappointed in that I'm not gonna lie But anyway, let's continue with the story. First, let me let me get my money. Oh, I'm sorry. Please make yourself comfortable. We had this kind of money because of all the work you've done. Take it. You deserve it. Well, thank you, kind man. If you'll excuse me, um, uh, I gotta store this cash. And then we're going to do her side mission. And after that, I think we're going to go move on to the next main mission. I just want to see what this side mission is all about. Got to unload some of this cash in the hollow. Be there soon. Make it fast. Watch where you're swerving, mate. Need to make a deposit, Better not lose this. Guess our business is done. How you doing? Is this what I rolled up in? Yeah. Nope. Now, real quick, let me work on her next mission. Hopefully, the side missions are like fully realized, like they are in Mass Effect, and it's not just. You know, cannon fodder. We're about to find out, though. Talk to Emmanuel. Is that a ramp? That is the most anticlimactic drop I think I've ever, I've ever took part in in a video game. What was that? That was complete garbage. They're Sammy's. 
So far, so good. Oh! Hopefully I don't get eaten by like an alligator or something. I know they're in this game. Uh, oh no, these are fully realized. Okay. Need to talk to Cassandra. She said you could use some help. Assuming you're a manual. Assume at your own whisk, Lincoln. Clay. Whisk? So running the weed, y'all got a routine laid out? We take a boat to the bayou, grab the bears, bring them back. Bayou can be a rough territory. Dixie Mafia knows every inch. <laughs> Does those white boys scare you, friend? Did they touch your zozo when you were a child? Sandra failed to mention your charming personality. Uh, I highly doubt she forgot. You do this kind of thing back in Haiti? Back in my country, I was a hoogan, a priest. What does a priest know about trafficking weed? I did not run marijuana halfway. My cargo was refugees, people. I saved their lives, mm -hmm. got them away from Duvalier. But you probably don't know much about that. We gonna have a problem, you and me? Cassandra says we are partners, that everything is cool between us. Are we cool? Don't think I call it that. Neither would I. Cassandra might be able to let go of what you did to our people, but I cannot. Maybe you'd be happier back in Haiti. It was not my chance to come here. Leave my home. Mm -hmm. But I'm um, trying to make the best of it. Aren't we all? There are still Dixie Mafia scattered around the hollow. If you have the time, you should see to them. Convince them to leave. Uh-huh. Trafficking is an optional way to increase an underboss's earn that allows them to pass along more kickback to you. Complete completing trafficking runs also uncovers more about your underboss's lieutenants and increases your underboss's loyalty. Make deliveries to rackets to increase their earning potential. You can continue to go after. A shipment of weed is being delivered down in the bayou. Get a boat, use it to bring everything back. Cassandra is a woman of great strength, fiercely independent. But sometimes she uses her independence to keep others at a distance. Thank you for that. Anyway. Let's see what we're working with as far as objectives go. Yeah, let me go ahead and smuggle some weed real quick. The goddamn Huifa is not going to get behind the wheels and drive itself here, boy. Where the fuck is it at? It's just, you mean to tell me? I know I didn't just. I know I did not. Forgetting what those motherfuckers did to this kidding? place, Mr. Clay. I won't either. No, I know there better be a boat somewhere around here. Drive the boat to the weed drop location. Okay, let me just. I was gonna say. I thought it brought me all the way back. Mm -mm. No copyright, no thank you. This may take me a moment. Wonderful night out for a drive though, you know? Oh, that's land. What the fuck? Which way am I supposed to? What is this bullshit? I can't see what's landing. Is that? Do I have like headlights I can turn on? 
something like that. Anything of that sort that might help me, you know, see where I'm going. That's what I do. But hey, what do I know? Pardon me. Good stuff, good stuff. It's raining out. See how they have lights? Where the fuck are my lights? I can't tell, I can't see anything, man. Nothing. I don't know if I'm driving on land, if I'm driving on... I probably made a wrong turn. Let me check. No, I'm on track. Okay. What time is it? You know? I wish my watch would tell me. I'm only doing this mission because more money. Then after that, we're going to go see my Irish homie. And that'll be that. Oh! Oh no! I'm about to go smuggle some weed. I feel like a rapper. Get in the book. What kind of bullshit is this? I was already in a book. Is that an alligator? Is that an alligator? Oh, yep, that's an alligator. <laughs> Which means I don't want to be in these waters at all. Uh-uh. Let me just drive this boat on top of here where I'm safe. Oh! So I'm stealing... Bye. Oh, oh. Now I've heard that you can pick people up and feed them the alligator. Let me try it. Here, gator, gator. Here, gator. I think he's too far away to notice. Oh, never mind. Let me just get in this boat and go on about my business. This broke down ass boat here. It doesn't even make any sounds. What is this? Oh, there we go. Oh, wait for the drop. Oops. Take the weed to the delivery. Don't tell me I have to get in this gator infested water. Take the weed delivery. How? These alligators will tear me to shreds, man. Alright, so we got the, the the weed. Apparently somehow I kicked out my mic. You didn't miss much. All I did was pick up the weed, put it in the boat, and we are on the way to smuggle it. Let's go. So that might be an awkward jump cut. I don't cut. I don't know how I'm gonna edit it because whenever I kick my mic out, 
uh, it makes the audio will sometimes, you know, force Sony Vegas to not be able to use it right because it's corrupted. And I don't know. We'll just have to figure out how it goes. I might have to render only a certain part. I mean, export only a certain part. I don't know. We'll find out. Fucking alligators here too, man. They're everywhere. I'm gonna turn that shit off. Deliver the weed to Cassandra Racket. Okay, good stuff. Am I gonna have to watch out for the 5 0? So I wonder if I fail one of these side missions, can I retry it? We're about to see. Oh shit. It's 5 0, man. Don't mind me, officer. Just doing my thing. Just doing my thing, man. Nothing to see here. La -de -da -da. But what's weird to me is like I'll stop in front of a red light, right? Because the cop is there and I have to obey the traffic laws. But somebody. Somebody behind me. Somebody behind me will honk at me and, you know, speed right past me. I don't get it. What happened to obey the traffic laws? I mean, I guess that is what that is. Fucking cops every... I like how there are no cops out and about when I'm just, you know, driving around doing my own thing. But as soon as I have a mission where I have precious cargo that could lead to me getting arrested, they're everywhere. The sky textures look a bit weird. Is that just me? Or do they actually look weird to the, weird to the rest of you guys? They look a bit pixelated. Cop, 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 cop. God damn it, you know? But they're everywhere. Oh, shit. Cassandra, why is your racket all the way out here? Please explain this to me. I like to do, you know, these side missions at least once fully, and then after that, I either do them all off the record, or I'll do, I'll start one, but then I'll cut to the end of it, and just go on about my business, but I like you guys to see, you know, what the, what the first mission is like. Oh no! Ooh, I'm sorry. There we go. Please explain to me why I have to do this all by myself, by the way. Good shit. Good shit. Weed delivery complete. Good stuff. Trafficking. Helping your underboxes. Underbus. Optional misses. Do I have more optional missions? I mean, I guess we can do another one, you know? Real quick. Let me go ahead and fill her up.
Thank you. Thank you, kind sir. If he has any new dialogue and this isn't just, you know. We're cleaning this place up right thanks to you. What is wrong with you? I'm a big man. Make some room. Look at me like I did you wrong. Ah, hey there, Fway. How is life running with her? I got it covered. Good. Because I'm getting word those Dixie Bouzons are starting to interfere with our dwarfs. They can try all that. I hate the way you talk. won't change the outcome. You getting in touch with your artistic side? My wife used to draw on anything she could get her hands on. Half the time, she didn't even realize what she was doing. And yet, every stroke was perfection. She's still back in Haiti? Yes. It is where she is buried. Guess we've all had our share of losses. Our losses, Frey, are nowhere near the same. I'm just trying to turn the page, set things right with you. And you think comparing the deaths of our loved ones will do that? Papa Doc had my wife tortured trying to locate me. He had the tonton I could bludgeon my children to death in order to save bullets. When I last saw my wife, her eyes had ruptured from the electroshock. My little boy. His face was caved in. And my little girl. She had been hit so hard she was decapitated. They were faultless. So you and me, Fue, we are nothing in common. Makano is an evil man. In that there is no question. But just because an evil man kills, it does not mean his victims are innocent. Innocence ain't a thing that exists around folks like us. At least not for long. Hell, I'm not even sure I know what it looks like anymore. I used to. Moss. But the bloody eye get the quick eye that picture fades. But that's not the important right now. Important thing is getting our weed back from the Dixie Mafia. A large shipment of marijuana is at this dock. Get it and bring it back. Not worth as much money, but we can sell everything you bring back. So that's another optional mission. So that was just the first of these optional missions. These are something I'll probably do off the record to expand you know how much money I'm getting back. 60, 66 bucks. What the fuck kind of profit is this? 66 bucks, man. I did all of that for 66 bucks. Bucks, man. All that driving. Man, fuck this side mission shit. I'm kind of cutting. Okay, let's see. As far as we know. Let's go ahead and talk to Mr. Irishman. Where's he at? Oh, he's all the way over here. Where's Vito at? I might just go ahead and go down. Or you know what? Let me let me go ahead and get the Irishman, you know. Oh! So now we drive all the way back. And you know, this driving actually is starting to get out of control. I'm probably going to start cutting around it. Just to uh, save recording time. So, I'll see you guys in just a minute. Alright, so it looks like we're here. It's a very rich neighborhood. Let's see what the deal is here. Oh, here we go with that copy, right? Try the back door. Alright. Why would I come in through the back? Oh. Uh, Bert. Why is it so bright? They can clear. Why is it so bright? Cross. Yeah, it's in everything. Oh. I heard you were dead. Been hearing that a lot. What the fuck do you want? Came here to make you a business proposition. Is that so? I'm going after Marcano, his brothers, anyone else that's associated with him. 
And what may help? The way I see it, once we deal with Barbieri, you get Point Vidam back. After that, we can discuss what happens to the rest of the city. <laughs> no, fuck off. I've all the chalky postures once already. Look where I got me. From where I'm standing, I'm not seeing much of a difference between then and now. You less than that, you less than God, you fuck. <laughs> Danny was so buttoned up, the coroner wouldn't let me get a last look. Anyone's killing that fucking Marcano. That's me. Unless Marcano's hanging around one of these dive bars, I don't think he has too much to worry about. Yeah, go fuck yourself. There's no more stones in the lakes of you, they're a fucking off. A fucking ingrate. Coming to your question, me. You and your cane, you are caught down run at the first sign of trouble. You always have. You always will. <sighs> Fucking keys. Oh, and me are going for a little ride. Oh, no. What a crazy you think you're doing. You were bragging about your stones, so I figured we'd take a little ride. See who cracks first, the Chalky or the Mick. Grace, you're gonna make the piss come out of me, Japs, eh? Come on, old man. It ain't the whiskey turning you green. Look at me. Look at me go. the wrong man to call out. Whoa, there. That one made me right in these teeth now. Yeah. Who has balls now? That's the shot. Maybe there's hope for you yet, you monkey bitch. <laughs> I like him already. That's the shot. Maybe there's hope for you yet, you monkey bitch. <laughs> all right, all right. You proved your point, you mongo sap. Pull over here. Now, get the fuck out of my raid. Don't pay me shop. We can talk business there. All right. So where do I go now? Yeah, that was really cool. Meet Burke. All right, let's do it. Conveniently, I'm right by the shop. What kind of luck is that? You know. Let's go. Drive like a madman. Fucking cops, man! You guys are everywhere. Go on about your business, bro. God, I'm actually having to wait for these lights. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is what mafia is like. Actually, obeying. I know you didn't. Stop dead ass in the middle of traffic. But I gotta obey traffic laws. What kind of bullshit? Lots of Irish brodies. I don't want to run any of them over. Lest I piss off Burke. You guys better move out the way. It's in your best interest. So is this not an entrance? This must be an entrance. Back so soon then. Tell me about Barbieri. Barbieri? 
Yeah. Barbier. Great fucking cunt. I can tell you that much. You know what I'm asking, Burke. Give me something I can use. Barbieri's running Splow out of the Sweetwater Distillery. Splow. Panther's piss. White mule. Alley gin. Pochain. Moonshine. You ignorant fuck. Christ, what can a booze you people drink over there in Darkyville? Kinda's of not called painter's piss. <laughs> Boy, you ain't lived. <laughs> Set the whole thing up myself. Then that gunny fuck comes in and takes it from me. Smashes me knee all to hell. barbieri has gonna suffer. You hear? Days. Slow. What else has he got besides the distillery? I run is that old Robert or Slaughterhouse. He's doing more in there than cutting a lean ribe. Drags in there. That's the end of you. I'll do the heavy lifting on this, Burke. Uh -huh. but once Barbieri's dead, I'm counting on you to step up. Oh, I'll do more than step up. I'll either be running this whole damn town or burning it to the ground. But honest, it'll make a whole lot of difference to me either way. <laughs> and yes, and once again. A nation once again. And the Ireland long, a province be a nation once again. This is so ridiculous. So, so what are we doing? You mean to tell me I can just... Need some wheels. And Burke says you're the only person we're talking to about it. Well... Burke's a fucking genius in that regard. I'll head on out to you now. What a... Talk to Nikki Burke. Thanks for the wheels, man. One car is promised. Appreciate it. Thank you. I like how I asked him to bring a car, but I didn't need him to because it was right here. I'm such an asshole. Lincoln, over here. Surprised to see you, Nikki. I know what you're planning on doing, and I couldn't just sit here and watch my old man send you out half cocked. Fuck. Man, your dad's never been much for details. Yeah, what he didn't tell you is that the man running the Sweetwater Distillery is named Carl Bevers. Hard ass, country asshole. Mm -hmm. His family runs the shine through the business, sells it to local shops. Bevers ever led on to where he keeps his stills? Uh, he's got brains enough to move things around. Rumor is he's got a map hit somewhere for his drivers. Hmm. Something like that could come in handy. Maybe I'll convince one of his men to tell me where it is. Hey, we've got another man. Goes by the name of Bear. Keeping an eye on the meatpacking plant. You should go see him. I'll do that. Thanks for the help. Anytime, Lincoln. I know what Bevis is up to. You're gonna have to get at some of his people. Story mission on I'll take one of these. Thank you. Open the map to select an objective. What do we got? So what is this one? What the fuck? Story chapters. Talk to Barry Dunley. Let me go ahead and take care of his enforcers. Actually, you know what? Let me talk to Bear Donley first. I don't know what you do because... And then when I go up... It doesn't go up, it goes down. When I go down on the map, it goes up. I don't get it. How far away is it? It's only like 200 clicks. I can take care of that.
Okay, get shit, get shit. Oh, fucking cops, man. They're everywhere in this neighborhood. Leave me alone, copper. Fucking five O oh, man. Now we wait for the light to turn green because I actually have to obey traffic laws. Good shit, they turned. All right, so combat. Select target L1. I'll leave them be for right now. Can I actually ram people? I don't know, I've never tried it. So I just walk in through the front door. Greetings and salutations and all that shit. We have a problem, sir. You bear? Nikki sent me. Oh, I gonna marry that girl someday. Bear Donnelly. I own Nikki's da. Everything. He has me keeping an eye on the Robert O. Meatpacking plant. Mm -hmm. Who's running things over there? Not job by the name of Sonny Blue. Let's a room out to the butcher's loan sharks. Protection guys, too. If they can't do it there, they put the hurt to people in the street. Any chance Sonny's around the Robert Doe? Fuck no. Sonny only comes around to scare his people into shape. But I'm here and one of his boys, a fella named Ralph, got caught skimming. They're working the bloody bastard over in the slaughterhouse to find out where he's got it stashed. Might be beneficial to pull his arse out of the fire. I'll see what I can get out of Sonny's goons. Watch your ass, Bear. People whose people are scared of him might not talk. Why not make him more scared of you? Okay, I don't know which, so I should be working on both of these, right? I gotta kill Sonny Beaver. So these are two dudes that I have to take out. Kill Sonny's enforcers, kill Beaver's enforcers. Okay, that's the plan, but I will work on that in the next part, guys. I want to thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more. Share this video around. What am I rocking? A shotgun? I can work with that. Uh, share this video around. Share it with your friends. Share it with other YouTubers. I don't care. Do what you can do to help me out, guys. I will catch you in the next part later on.